Welcome everyone. So today we are going to solve a very nice geometry problem, but it is involving percentages. Okay. So when you have something like this, in this case, what you should be doing is first we'll talk about basics. See, they are saying the radius of a circle is increased by twenty five percent, and we need to find the area. Okay. So now let's say let the new a new radius be what capital R, and the original radius will be small r. And because you are saying it's increased, so we'll do plus twenty five upon hundred of the original radius. Okay, so this eventually comes out to be when you take r outside, you're left with what one plus twenty five upon hundred. Okay, so from here I'll get capital R as small r into hundred plus twenty five upon hundred. So basically, what we are doing is our capital R is coming out to be one twenty five into small r upon hundred. So now, if you look, this is cancelling twenty five fours are and twenty five fives are. Therefore, I can say capital R is nothing but what five by time five upon four times r. This is very very important for you to do. No, okay. Now, when you go back, okay. So your basically we got this as what. Capital R is what five upon four times R. And we need to find the percentage increase. Now, please understand, percentage increase is nothing but what change upon original into hundred. So now, what is my change? My change is what pi capital R square minus pi. Small r square upon original, which is pi small r square into hundred. Okay, so now let's take pi outside. I am left with what capital R square instead of capital R square. I'll write this as what five upon four into small r the whole square minus r square upon pi r square into hundred. Now, <clears throat> what happens is the pi is cancelling, and I'm left with what pi five upon four r square, the whole square basically. So we get what twenty five upon sixteen r square minus r square upon r square into hundred. So this then comes out to be see again the r squares can be taken outside. So I'm left with what twenty five upon sixteen minus one upon r square. In two hundred, so this is cancelling. Then I'm left with what twenty five minus one, up twenty five upon sixteen minus one in two hundred. Okay, so this when taken in LCM, you get what twenty five minus sixteen, which is what nine upon sixteen in two hundred. So now, if you look closely, this is fourza and this is twenty fiveza. Both of them go by four table. So you're left with what two twenty five upon four, which is coming out to be fifty six point two five percent. This is your answer for this particular question. That's it for today. I will see you in the next video.